Kemba, you ever sit back and just reflect on the last year you guys had just after really not being expected to have that great of a year and then just win the national championship and uh, now you're here as one of the top picks possibly in the NBA draft. Do you just sit back and reflect on, on this last year? Um, all the time, all the time. Um, it's been you know, uh, a surreal year for us, you know, for me and my teammates. And, you know, um, you know it's, it's, it's something I would never forget. Um, you know, I, my whole college career has, has been, you know, a great ride for me. And, you know, it, I put myself in position, you know, to, to be pick high. And, you know, my, my teammates did and my coaching staff did. So, you know, um, you know I'm, I'm just extremely, you know, fortunate and, and, you know, thankful for that. How much help has the UConn Brotherhood, the guys that have already been pro, have, have they been of any help to you at all? You said the guys that have already been pro? You, the guys that went pro from UConn. Um, not really. Not really. Um, you know, I speak to guys here and there. Um, they, they tell me a little bit about the process and stuff like that, but um, you know, I'm, I'm just I'm just taking it all in. You know, I'm just I'm just going through the process myself. People talk about you know oh he's small oh he's this scoring bar this. Do you think if people underestimate the value of a winner, a guy that just knows how to win and like yourself that just leads his team to victory time after time? Oh, um, not at all. You know, I think I think teams know that you know, I'm a winner, and you know me. Me speaking with you know a lot of the teams today, they all told me you know that you know one thing they love about me is that I'm a winner. Um, you know a lot of them even told me that you know my height is not even a concern. Um, and as long as it's not a concern to them, it's not, it's not a concern to me. So you know, there's no problem with that. Um, last summer playing with Team USA, you know playing against those big time point guards, uh, how did that help you? And also, do you, do you think that you know playing out there kind of showed that you can be a real point guard in the NBA? Uh, definitely. Um, you know, playing with the USA Select team has definitely helped me a lot. Um, you know, playing against a lot of the, you know, all stars, you know, um, point guards. Um, it was a, it was a great experience. You know, I got a chance to, you know, learn the, 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 the pace of the game. Um, you know, which is an extremely different pace from, you know, the collegiate level to the NBA level. Um, and it, it, it really helped me. It really helped me. Um, it, it, it was a really humbling experience for me. Um, you know, it just gave me a lot of confidence going into my junior season. When you get your first NBA paycheck, what's the first thing you're going to buy? What's the first thing I'm going to buy? Um, I don't know. I'll probably give it to my parents. Just give the whole check to your parents? I'll give the whole thing to my parents. What's the first thing you're going to buy, though, at, so, uh, at some point? I have no idea. I have no idea. Um, New car? Nah. House? I, I, I'm, not, I'm not into the flashy stuff like that. So. Nah? Yeah, I have no idea right now. All right.